I'm going to do another podcast episode really about what depression feels like, but I think we have it all wrong in society. People try to put it into words, which is so hard. It's so hard to put a feeling into words. You have to experience it. So people say it's a black cloud. Bullshit. It's not a black cloud. A black cloud? People can deal with a black cloud. I could deal with a black cloud. People say it's like having a, a really heavy knapsack on. Your whole body is heavy. I can deal with that. You kidding me? Oh, it's, you're just a little heavier. Come on. It's like Winston Churchill saying it's the big black dog that you carry. Psh, so what? I'll walk a dog. People say that it's the saturation in life is turned down. It's just a little gloomy. The colors aren't as full. No, not for me. The colors are great. Actually, the colors can be more vivid when I'm depressed. So everyone's different, right? And we try to put these this feeling into words, into metaphors, and it doesn't work. And here's something that Jordan Peterson said, I think, and Michaela Peterson said, which really does depression justice of how bad it can be and how withdrawal felt for me. It's like, imagine you wake up in the, in the morning, every morning, and you realize for the first time that your whole family's dead. That's far worse than a black dog. That's far worse than a dark black cloud following you everywhere. Imagine the horror Imagine the absolute horror. The world is the scariest place you can possibly imagine. The present's scary. You can't reflect on the past because that's just as scary because it led you here. And then the future, it's going to be full of death anyways. You don't have your family anymore. You have absolute horror everywhere you look. So there's nowhere to run. Now, we wonder why people take their own life, why, why they die by suicide. Does that make sense now? That imagine you woke up, guys. Imagine you woke up and realized that everyone you cared about is dead and you're completely alone. And you have to deal with that forever. There's no way out. That's what depression feels like. That's what it feels like. That's not sadness. That's, that's real depression. That's withdrawal from an antidepressant after being on it for 12 years. So that hit me. 